All right, this is Linux Gamer Rep. I am Rep, I am a gamer, and I use Linux. I noticed on my last video, the last demo I did was for the Outer Worlds. And the frames were really low on that. It was in the teens. As you can see here on this still, I was getting 16 frames per second. Um, that's not really good. The last time I played through it, the last two times, they were sitting in the 40s, 50s through the entire game. Now, I will be losing some frames for recording the video, but, you know, I, it's to be expected. Alright, so if we go into uh, Steam on the Outer Worlds, you'll notice this isn't one of their titles because I actually had it on my Windows machines before, and once that crashed, I moved it over to Linux. Then I added the game through the add game button down here to add a non-Steam game. And then if you actually had it on Steam, you probably activate it here too with activate a product on Steam. So, so in here, let's right click it, go to properties, go to compatibility. Now when I came in here last time, it was either set on 802 or experimental. Those normally don't work well, so I don't use those very often. Now, I tried it out after the video on 6.38, and it worked great, but all the cutscenes were missing. So, I tried it on 7.06, and that worked great too with the cutscenes, so that's what we'll be using today. Put that on, fire it up, and the company intros are part of the cutscenes too. If you use 638, these will not show up. Which I mean, if, if you are going without cutscenes, then that, that's pretty good. Might be in your best interest to use 638, I don't know. So, we'll go ahead and continue since I already started it up just for testing. This is actually a pretty good game. If you, you know, like a mix between, say, Fallout and the Borderlands series. Ah, he didn't even notice I was there. Get my. Let's say hi. Huh? Alright, let's go back to the guy that we still framed. Let's have a look and see what the frames are on that. So far we're hitting in the 30s, 40s. Thanks for patching me up. You hit your head or something? You're in Emerald Vale. We're a Spacer's Choice community. Edgewater's a little ways down. Uh, prettiest place in the Vale. Uh, be sure to stop by a provisioner's for a can of our famous salt tuna. All right, let's go ahead and get out of here. Okay. See, as you can see, there is a vast improvement there. By right-clicking, going to Properties and Compatibility, you can make changes on which version of Proton you'll be using. Um, some do work better for other games, vice versa. So if one doesn't work, come in here, try a different one, and see if it works better. But for my system, my setup, 706 is the choice. Okay. All right, that's it for me. This has been Rep, signing off.